We're excited about the Mandalorian Season 2 just because of Baby Yoda. And, well, now we're getting Ahsoka in there, apparently. We also have more big news coming up right now, so make sure to hit that like and subscribe button if the Force is with you. If you love the Mandalorian, or in general, if you just love Baby Yoda, hit that like and subscribe button and never miss out content like this on a daily basis, as well as comment down below. Let me know your guys' thoughts on this. Are you guys excited for this news coming up that we're about to discuss that you probably saw in the thumbnail and the description? And as well, guys, I'm so excited to discuss this, so let's just talk about this. News right here is Tamora Morrison, who played Jango Fett originally in Attack of the Clones, and also most notably from Aquaman. He played Aquaman's father. Pretty cool stuff in there he is returning to the star wars universe not as jango fett though as boba fett oh my god we knew this was coming though after season one ended we saw those boots walk up we heard the clanking and everyone went yeah that's boba fett. i was kind of still hoping that maybe we would have we would have gotten a cad bane i know a lot of people wanted cad bane back some people said yeah he died off screen he might have died off screen but they can always bring him back in some capacity i mean darth maul came back and this dude got cut in half but still, this is very exciting news. Um, one thing that particularly keep interested, and some people might not know this if they're not huge into Star Wars. I mean, people need to remember that there were tons of clones of him, and Boba Fett is technically a clone of him, just a younger version. That's the one he took in. Very exciting stuff in here to see that we are getting Boba Fett back into this world. Something very much expected, and the Hollywood Reporter did end up breaking this, so that is something I do have to give him credit for. But sources say that Morrison will play Boba Fett, the famed bounty hunter who first appeared on the big screen in 1980s Star Wars The Empire Strikes Back. Technically, he starred in the Christmas special first, but whatever. He died in 1983's Return of the Jedi as he fell into the Sarlacc Pit, which we, come on, he didn't. He didn't fall into the Starlight Pit. He fell in, but he crawled his way out because we know he's a badass. And um, actor Jeremy Bullich, who uh, portrayed the character in the original trilogy, he's not coming back. But Boba Fett is expected to play just a small role in the season two of the series after the character was teased in the season one episode of The Gunslinger, the one that we just discussed. It was pretty obvious he was coming back. Oh, he will be playing a small role in here. I think this could either extend to maybe a season three, a season four of The Mandalorian, but also just like how they're doing with Ahsoka, this could be a way of maybe segueing in to a spin-off series with Boba Fett that I would actually be really excited for because here's the thing even though the actor is a little bit older than say some of the other people who would be doing the stunts in here something we do have to keep in mind is that you know he might just be doing the voice he might be on set sometimes but all the time you don't need him behind the suit it's really a man behind the mask and I think that's pretty interesting to say the least and we were gonna have a Boba Fett solo film just a couple years back maybe they end up turning that into a Disney Plus series who knows at this point? This is exciting news, guys, and I'm really curious to hear what your guys' thoughts are on this. So make sure to comment down below. Let me know your guys' thoughts. Are you guys excited for this? Did you guys see this happening? Did you not? Were you expecting someone else to come back? I'm really curious to hear your guys' thoughts. I'm excited that they're at least bringing him back. Morrison is a really great actor, and as Jango Fett, I loved him in there, and to see him be able to play Boba Fett is even more exciting. I'm more curious to see how Boba Fett got out and how he got out of the Sarlacc Pit. I've always wanted a Boba Fett-centric story of him maybe falling into the Sarlacc Pit and having to fight certain things in there and then the end of the film is him crawling out i think that would be badass let me know how you guys think boba fett survived would you guys want something like that i'm so curious and of course guys make sure to stay tuned for more star wars news coming up later down the road so of course until next time may the force be with you all and stay classy